brand new week and we've come your way again with our computer tech tip for the week which is going to be presented to you by Alexa our personal assistant shortly after that we're going to review and demonstrate a smart tech device so don't go away today I'm going to give you a tip on how to prolong your laptop battery batteries will eventually die no matter what but there are a few things you can do to prolong its lifespan according to wired Keeping your laptop plugged in can kill your battery faster. This is because of the way that lithium batteries work. Each cell in a lithium battery is charged to a voltage level and the higher the charge percentage, the higher the voltage level. The higher the voltage level, the more stress the battery is put under. The ideal charge for a battery is around 80% before you should unplug and let it drain to 40%. Doing this can prolong your battery life by as much as 4 times. Heat also isn't good for batteries. Batteries will degrade naturally, but extreme heat can cause them to degrade even faster by making the cells expand and bubble. So keep the fans clear, keep the laptop out of your lap and off of pillows and let air circulate through the fans unobstructed. Thank you. Thank you very much Alexa. So that was our tech tip for the week, taking care of your battery. If you want to know more about how your lithium battery works, you can head on to batteryuniversity.com. We have a whole lot of information about how your laptop battery works. The smart tech device we're going to demonstrate today is called a Wi-Fi smart plug. And these devices can be remotely controlled from anywhere around the world using a mobile app, either to turn on or off a device that is connected to it. And they can be joined with other smart devices which will enable you to use tools such as IFTT, which stands for if this, then that, to combine tax. For example, you can program the light in your room to turn on whenever you walk in. There are a whole lot of creative things you can do with a smart plug, which will be discussed right after the demonstration. My name is Enoch, and this is STEC Studios. In this demonstration, I'm going to show you how to power this light bulb here connected to a lamp holder using the smart plug. I've already done the setup and everything. I've connected my smart plug to the Wi-Fi. That is why you see a circle light here, which means that the device is online and can be controlled from anywhere around the world. And I've also connected my phone to the internet so that I can be able to control the smart plug here so first things first what I'm going to do now is to launch the app on my phone so I'm going to launch the app now alright so as you can see I have a socket one already set up inside my app socket one is the smart plug you see here I'm going to try and turn it on to see whether the light bulb will turn on so all right so that is how it is turning it off back on back off so you can be anywhere around the world and you can control this smart plug all right when you click on the socket one you will notice that you can be able to set a countdown timer and you can also be able to schedule times when you want the device to turn on or off so let's try something out with a countdown timer let me set it to one minute so as you can see it has started reading counting down started from 60 seconds it's going down let's wait and see whether it's going to turn on the light bulb at the end of the countdown 8 7 6 5 4 3 2 1 0 yes so that is how it works the countdown timer 
let's set a shadow to 10 of the device is now uh, 10 29 let's set it to Let's set it to 1030 to turn off the device. Okay, it's already 1030. Let's set it to 1031. So we've set it to 1031 to turn off the device. Let's save. Go back and wait for 1031. So the shadow is active waiting for 1031 to see if the device will go off. Yes, yeah, so it's 1031, the device is off. That is how the smart plugs work. There are a whole lot of things you can do with this smart plug. Let's go to smart automation let's add an automation let's add an automation for light switch on let, it, let us set that anytime someone turns this light switch on she send us a notification on our phones so let me save so I've set an automation that anytime this smart socket is turned on, a notification should be sent to my phone. Let's see how it works. Let me go to home and turn on the device. Yes, I've gotten a notification. Turn it off. Let me turn it back on to see whether we we'll still get a notification. All right, so if you want to monitor your kids, you can set an automation on a smart plug so that anytime they turn on the socket, a notification is sent to you to notify you that the kids have turned on the socket to the TV or the socket to any other device you want to monitor through this smart plug. Okay, so now let's discuss other creative ways this smart plug can be used. One creative way to use a smart plug is to be able to pinpoint appliances that are consuming much electricity. When you connect your appliance through a smart plug you can track how much electricity it consumes. If you don't want to buy 10 smart plugs, you can always plug one appliance at a time to a smart plug. You can then track how much each appliance consumes and you will know you exactly what's using the most electricity. With this knowledge, you will be able to decide, without a doubt which appliance will shave the most of your energy bill if you replace it. You can also keep the appliances connected to the smart plug so you can turn it off from work if you forgot to turn it off before leaving home. Another way is to set up for less vampire power. Vampire power is the power your electronic devices use when they are on standby. And this can make up to 10% of your electricity bills. Some of the biggest standby power energy suckers are Laptops and desktop computers heaters and ACs, Wi-Fi modems, printers and scanners, TVs, set-top boxes, DVD players and game consoles, phone chargers, microwaves, blenders and other kitchen appliances. When you connect your appliances to smart plugs, you can switch them off from your phone when you're about to leave the house or go to sleep. Or, you can schedule them to turn off when you know you won't be using them. This way, you can save power without even thinking about it. Automating other devices with the smart plug is another creative way. With the smart plug, you can schedule your appliances to turn off and on at the perfect times. This means that whether it's sunny or the weather is cold, you can set a time for your air conditioner, fan or heater to turn on. Welcome to the future, where you get to enjoy your home at the perfect temperature when you get home from a hard day at work. Or when you get up in the morning, or just any time really. You can also trick burglars into thinking someone's home when you're on holidays. 
If you're going away over the weekend or heading overseas for a holiday, you might want to create the illusion that you're home. You can do this by setting up a smart plug with a lamp near a window. All you have to do is connect your lamp to the smart plug, then you can set timers for your lights to come on at night to create the illusion of activity and warn off intruders. You can travel relaxed knowing that your home is looking after itself. It can also come in handy during 31st night when all members of the house go to church. Your laptop and mobile phone are two things that you need to charge quite often, and yet they do not need to be charged for 8 hours plus at a time. In fact, it's actually bad for their batteries if they remain on the charger for longer than necessary. For many of us, it's built into our routine to put our phone on the charger when we go to bed so that it's fully charged and ready to go for the next day. A smart plug lets you do just this the easy way. By connecting your charger through a smart plug, you can run it on a schedule that automatically turns off the power at a set time. This could save you hundreds of Ghana CDs in new batteries, or thousands in new phones, over time. Having trouble enforcing rules on how much TV can be watched, or how long the Xbox or PlayStation can be played. Smart plugs can help you manage your children's screen time and put into place a healthy after-school routine. You can also make sure no one is getting up in the night to play games when they are meant to be sleeping, turn off the power when you go to bed. The simple use of a smart plug on a schedule makes it easy to put a regular routine like this into practice. You can also reduce your chance of electrical fire using a smart plug. Any electrical appliance has the potential to start fires or cause an electric shock, and each brings with it its own dangers, ranging from frightening to life-threatening. A few of the common culprits are toasters, microwaves, clothes dryers and dishwashers. Ensuring these appliances are switched off using a smart plug whenever you're not using them will cut down on the chance that one of your appliances will have a fault and catch fire when you are sleeping or out of the house. How's that for peace of mind? Thank you for watching this video. Please visit our YouTube channel XTechIT support and subscribe to our channel so you don't miss any of our tech videos. Give us a like. Share and comment.